When an aldehyde or a ketone is treated with an excess of an alcohol and the catalytic amount of a strong acid, an acetal is formed. The mechanism is found to be acid catalyzed in which the proton activates the carbonyl, causing enhanced reactivity with alcohol. Trapping of one molecule of alcohol gives a hemiacetal, which reacts further to produce the acetal. The reaction is reversible, a molecule of water is the byproduct, and the catalyst is reformed in the last step. Since the reaction is carried out at low pH, the first step is proton transfer to the carbonyl oxygen. The conjugate acid is then seen to be a highly electrophilic resonant stabilized carbocation. A molecule of the solvent then traps the carbocation to give a protonated hemiacetal. In order for the reaction to progress, a reversible proton transfer occurs to set up a water leaving group. Loss of water then reveals a second resonance stabilized intermediate that is highly electrophilic. Nucleophilic attack on the electrophile by alcohol solvent produces the conjugate acid of the acetal. Finally, proton transfer back to the solvent gives the acetal and also regenerates the acid catalyst. Overall, treatment of an aldehyde or a ketone with an excess of an alcohol and an acid catalyst results in the formation of a base stable but acid sensitive acetal. The acetal serves as a useful functional group for aldehydes and ketones, and it is stable to the basic environments used in reductions and Grignard chemistry. However, they are quite sensitive to aqueous acid, in which they are converted back to the original aldehyde or ketone. Hydrolysis of the acetal group is acid catalyzed, with initial protonation setting up a good leaving group, and loss of this generates a resonant stabilized carbocation. Water from the solvent traps this intermediate, and a hemiacetal is formed which then undergoes proton transfer to set up a second good leaving group. Loss of this group affords the resonance stabilized conjugate acid of the aldehyde or ketone product, and deprotonation gives the carbonyl and also regenerates the acid catalyst. In the first step, the acid catalyst protonates an acetal oxygen to set up a good alkoxonium leaving group, which then breaks off reversibly to give a resonance stabilized carbocation. A molecule of water from the solvent traps the intermediate to produce a protonated hemiacetal. Then a simple proton transfer to the alkoxide oxygen sets up a second alkoxonium leaving group. Collapse of this species with loss of a molecule of the alcohol then gives the penultimate species in the form of a resonant stabilized carbocation. Finally, loss of the proton back to the solvent provides the deprotonated carbonyl while also recycling the acid catalyst. The mechanism is the reverse of acetal formation and complements the use of acetals as protecting groups in synthesis.